What's good? What's poppin'? More going. It's your boy Lynx, and welcome back. So today we checking out the women's exclusive UNC to Chicago Air Jordan One OG. Let's get it. All right. So let's check out the box. So as you can see. They use the same box that they use in the Jordan Fairless series, which is a red box with black logos versus the typical box used to be black box with red logos. So you see here it says Women's Air Jordan 1 High OG. You see this is a size 12 in women's. I wear a size 10 and a half in men's and this is the size equivalent. While this is an exclusive women's sneaker, they did come out with them in extended sizes. They usually they stop at like women's 12. It's usually, so I usually get lucky. Just women's 12, I could get I could get those to match my size. If you wear sneakers bigger than a 10 and a half men's, you're usually out of luck. And they did extended sizes. I forgot how far they went up. Anytime you do extended sizes, it's gonna be a gold rush for guys to go grab these sneakers, especially a sneaker that looks like this. So, you know, men are gonna give the women competition and get in the sneaker first. Maybe they should have came out with men's sizes and women's sizes. So, you know, men get to get and women get to get so that women get a better chance of getting these sneakers because just like me, there's a lot of guys that's gonna want these. So let's take it out of the box and check it out. So, yeah, these are clean. These remind me of the Jordan 1's top three a little bit. So let's check it out. Pretty much the same thing on both. I think the only difference, let me take these out, straight to it. Usually don't talk about this first, but the insides. So once when the right foot is red on the inside and the the left foot is blue on the inside. So they didn't change the colors up any, anywhere else. So like the bottom is, they're both red. So that out the way. Very simple sneaker, but just clean and dope. All leather, all leather all around, except for the tongue, which is a classic, thick, fat Jordan 1 tongue that you're used to. Still wish they did this tongue for the Fearless Reflective or Reflective sneak I did in the last video. If you didn't see that, click the link over here. But um, they did, they used that same patent leatherish 3M material on the tongue. It was like a slight disappointment there. I love this thick material tongue that they usually use. But like I said, leather everywhere. Even the hang tag is leather. This is cool. Red leather hang tag. This is a great detail. So yeah, black leather on most of the sneaker from the toe buck to the side, even in the back. Um, red in the in the toe box, so you got the red toe going on here. And the blue in the Nike check and going all around to the back. Black Air Jordan logo, red Nike, Nike Air logo on the tongue. Uh, midsole is white and the bottom is red. I mean, not much to say about these other than these are cool. These, these are, this is the Jordan one that I want. This is, this is the colorway that I want. If I didn't get another Jordan one, I think I'd be happy with this. You know, a lot of people love the red and black, the straight red and black, red, red toed breads, whatever. I like this, I like that blue and red together. It's always cool. So just like the, the other Fearless patent leather with this similar color scheme, it was a little bright. It had more white instead of black. So this one is more black with the blue and red versus white with the blue and red. Those are still pretty. And you could click the link here again. So check those out. But yeah. But yeah, these are... Women's exclusive Jordan 1's 
UNC to Chicago, dope. I mean, it's simple and dope. You get some close up details of these. You can see that nice crack of leather. Yeah, these are gonna get rocked a lot. Hopefully I don't destroy them quickly. Cause I could, you know, these are one of those sneakers. Again, it's easy to just throw them on for anything, especially with some blue jeans, just rock them every day. Which I won't because that's just me. <laughs> I like to preserve my sneakers. I do wear my sneakers, but not, I don't run them into the ground. So yeah, if you like these sneakers, if you try to get them, listen, women, let's, let's, if you, I don't know if I have a lot of um, female subscribers at the moment, but um, at least sneakerheads. If you tried to get them, if you wanted to get them, you was unable, let me know in the comments down below. Um, fellas, if you got them, if you're able to get your size, what do you think about them? Um, yeah, leave a comment down below and let me know. Subscribe, like, share with a friend. All right, so until next time, peace. Yeah, these are definitely a go to the movies, go to the mall shopping hanging out on the weekend kind of chill flex vibe those are the patent leathers that's for the exclusive barbecues the day parties game nights you know what i mean these are the everyday rocking